This is Prahlad in advanced asana class. It's two hours and 23 minutes, and it was taped in 2006. Haryom Tat Sat. Before we start the class, we start with a small relaxation. You lay down on the mat. Keep your feet apart, hands apart. Make yourself comfortable on the floor. Close your eyes. Relax the face. Then focus your mind on your breathing. Inhale on one, on two, on three, on four. Exhale on one, on two, on three, on four. Breathe with rhythm. Mentally suggesting. Release all the tensions from your body and mind in preparation for the pranayama and the yoga asanas that we are going to do. Relax. 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 together stretch both arms over behind your head inhale get good stretch to the body stretch 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 exhale now inhale sit up cross your legs keep the back straight close your eyes Focus your mind on your breathing.
गजानम भूतगणाधिसेतजूपलसारभक्षक उमासुद शोक विनाशकारण नमा विघ्नेशरपादपंकज षडाननम कुंकुमरक्तवर्णम महामहिम दिव्यमयूरवाहनम रुद्र से सूनम सुरसैन्यनाद गुहम सदा शरण प्रपत्ति या कुंदेन्दुतुषारहारदला या शुभ्रवस्त्रृता या वीना वरदंडमंडितक या श्वेतपद्मासना या ब्रह्माच्युत शंकर प्रभृतिर्देव सदा पूजिता सां पाद सरस्वती भगवती निशेष्य जाड्यापहा ओं नम शिवाय गुरव सच्चिदनंदमूर्त निष्प्रपंचाय शाताय श्री शिवानंदय ते नम श्री विष्णुदेवानंदय ते नम ओं सर्वंगलमे शिव सर्वाधसाधि शरण्ये त्रयंबके गौरी नारायणी नमोस्तु ते नारायणी नमोस्तु ते ओ शाति 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 हरों तत्स नाउ वी स्टार्ट द क्लास विद द प्राणायाम विल बी डूइंग फाइव राउंड्स ऑफ कपाल भाति सो क्रॉस योर लेग्स Keep the back straight, shoulders relaxed, head straight, chin parallel to the floor. Now, as you inhale, expand your diaphragm, three quarters of your lungs. Exhaling, contract your abdomen in. Inhale, exhale. Now inhale deep, play, and begin. One, two, 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 one. Two, one, 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 two, one. Two, one, 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 two. Exhale. Inhale. Exhale. Now inhale deep. Play and hold the breath. Now while you hold the breath, try not to feel any pressure in your lungs. Just to feel that heat producing in your body. that produced heat is activating the energy the kundalini feel that energy passing up through the spine for better concentration you repeat your mantra mentally if you do not have mantra 
you can always repeat the universal mantra om Now with control exhale inhale exhale second round inhale d play and begin 1 2 1 2 1 2 1 Hold the breath comfortably. with control exhale inhale exhale third round inhale deep play and begin one Two 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 one
two, one, 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 two, exhale. Inhale, exhale, now inhale deeply, hold the breath comfortably, the more you focus, the easier for the energy to Pass through different chakras. Keep your focus and concentration at the base of the spine. Mentally, totally be relaxed. With control, exhale, inhale, exhale, now fourth round, inhale, deep, play, and begin. One, two, 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 Exhale, now inhale deeply, hold the breath comfortably.
with control exhale inhale exhale fifth and last round you inhale deep play and begin 
you keep your left hand in chin mudra palm facing up right hand in vishnu mudra face should be totally relaxed shoulders are relaxed you inhale deeply exhale completely then close the right nostril with the thumb inhale through left arm one arm two arm three arm four close retain the breath focus the mind in between eyebrows this is to balance the flow of prana in your body through right exhale on one on two on three on four on five on six on seven on eight inhale on one on two on three on four close spine straight through left exhale on one on two on three on four on five on six on seven on eight inhale on one on two on three on four close on each retention mentally you count the numbers up to 16 through right exhale on one on two on three on four on five on six on seven on eight inhale on one on two on three on four close through left exhale on one on two on three on four on five on six on seven on eight inhale on one on two on three on four close through right exhale on one on two on three on four on five on six on seven on eight inhale on one on two on three on four close through left exhale on one on two on three on four on five on six on seven on eight inhale on one on two on three on four close through right exhale on one on two on three on four on five on six on seven on eight inhale on one on two on three on four close through left exhale on one on two on three on four on five on six on seven on eight inhale on one on two on three 
Om for claws. Right. Exhale on one, on two, on three, on four, on five, on six, on seven, on eight. Inhale on one, on two, on three, on four. Close. Through left, exhale on one, on two, on three, on four, on five, on six, on seven, on eight. Inhale on one, on two, on three, on four, on five. Hold. Now you count up to twenty numbers. Mentally, you repeat your mantra as well. Think of the benefits when you are doing the pranayama. Try not to let your mind wander here and there. Through right, exhale on one, on two, on three, on four, on five, on six, on seven, on eight, on nine, on ten. Inhale on one, on two, on three, on four. On five. Very good. Keep that focus and concentration. Through left. Exhale. On one. On two. On three. On four. On five. Om six, om seven, om eight, om nine, om ten. Inhale om one, om two, om three, om four, om five. Through right, exhale on one, on two, on three, on four, on five, on six, on seven, on eight, on nine, on ten. Inhale on one, on two, on three, on four, on five. Close. Put the back straight once again. Make sure you are sitting up from the base of the spine. Through left, exhale on one, on two, on three, on four, on five, on six, on seven, on eight, on nine, on ten. Inhale on one, on two, on three, on four, on five. Close. Right. Exhale on one, on two, on three, on four, on five, on six, on seven, on eight, on nine, on ten. Inhale on one, on two, on three, on four, on five. Through left, exhale on one, on two, on three, on four, on five, on six, 
ओम सेवन ओम एट ओम नाइन ओम टेन इनहेल ओम वन ओम टू ओम थ्री ओम फोर ओम फाइव क्लोज लास्ट टू राउंड्स Right exhale. Om one, om two, om three, om four, om five, om six, om seven, om eight, om nine, om ten. Inhale. Om one, om two, om three, om four, om five. Left exhale. Om one, om two, om three, om four, om five, om six, om seven, om eight, om nine, om ten. Inhale. Om one, om two, om three, om four, om five. Close. Last round. Right exhale. Om one, om two, om three, om four, om five, om six, om seven, om eight, om nine, om ten. Inhale. Om one, om two, om three, om four, om five. Left exhale. Om one, om two, om three, om four, om five, om six, om seven, om eight, om nine, om ten. Drop the hands. You inhale. Exhale. Inhale. Exhale. Now stretch your legs straight in front of you. Shake your legs. Relax the ankles, knees, thighs. Then gently roll back. Lay down. Feet apart. Hands apart. Close your eyes. Relax. 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 bring the feet together we'll be doing the sun salutations now you stretch both arms over behind your head inhale good stretch to the body stretch 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 exhale inhale sit up gently stand up keep your feet together 
relax your shoulders head straight take couple of deep breaths mentally preparing yourself for sun salutations the surya namaskar we'll do few rounds with the regular breathing normally the way it is supposed to be and the last round i'd like you to hold the posture when you are in the posture you breathe this way you will be able to exercise properly feeling that posture and meditate in that posture now you inhale deeply exhale palms together prayer position inhale stretch your arms up and arch back try not to bend the knees exhale bend forward all the way fix the palms down inhale right leg backward right knee down look up open the chest hold the breath take the other leg body parallel exhaling drop the knees chest forward head down hips up inhale head up chest up arch back exhale hips up push your heels onto the floor triangle inhale right leg forward all the way left knee down look up exhale left leg also inhale stretch your arms up and arch back exhale inhale now exhale palms together prayer position inhale stretch your arms up and arch back exhale bend forward all the way. inhale left leg backward hold the breath take the other leg exhaling drop the knees chest forward inhale head up chest up exhale hips up push your heels onto the floor inhale left leg forward all the way right knee down exhale right leg also inhale stretch your arms up and arch back exhale inhale now exhale palms together prayer position inhale stretch your arms up and arch back exhale bend forward all the way inhale right leg backward hold the breath take the other leg exhaling drop the knees chest forward inhale head up chest up exhale hips up push your heels onto the floor inhale right leg forward all the way left knee down exhale left leg also inhale stretch your arms up and arch back exhale inhale now exhale palms together prayer position inhale stretch your arms up and arch back exhale bend forward all the way inhale left leg backward Hold the breath take the other leg exhaling drop the knees chest forward inhale head up chest up exhale hips up inhale left leg forward exhale right inhale stretch your arms up and arch back exhale inhale now exhale palms together prayer position inhale stretch your arms up and arch back exhale bend forward all the way inhale right leg backward hold the breath take the other leg exhaling drop the knees chest forward inhale head up chest up exhale hips up push your heels onto the floor inhale right leg forward all the way left knee down exhale left leg also inhale stretch your arms up and arch back exhale inhale now exhale palms together prayer position inhale stretch your arms up and arch back exhale bend forward all the way inhale left leg backward hold the breath take the other leg exhaling drop the knees chest forward inhale head up chest up exhale hips up inhale left leg forward exhale right inhale stretch your arms up and arch back exhale inhale now exhale palms together prayer position inhale stretch your arms up and arch back exhale bend forward all the way 
Inhale, right leg backward. Hold the breath, take the other leg. Exhaling, drop the knees, chest, forehead. Inhale, head up, chest up. Exhale, hips up, push your heels onto the floor. Inhale, right leg forward all the way, left knee down. Exhale, left leg also. Inhale, stretch your arms up and arch back. Exhale. Inhale, now exhale, palms together, prayer position. Inhale, stretch your arms up and arch back. Exhale, bend forward all. Inhale, left leg backward. Hold the breath, take the other leg. Exhaling, drop the knees, chest, forehead. Inhale, head up, chest up. Exhale, hips up. Inhale, left leg forward. Exhale, right. Inhale, stretch your arms up and arch back. Exhale. Inhale, now exhale, palms together, prayer position. Inhale, stretch your arms up and arch back. Exhale, bend forward all the way. Inhale, right leg backward. Hold the breath, take the other leg. Exhaling, drop the knees, chest, forehead. Inhale, head up, chest up. Exhale, hips up, push your heels onto the floor. Inhale, right leg forward all the way, left knee down. Exhale, left leg also. Inhale, stretch your arms up and arch back. Exhale. Inhale, now exhale, palms together, prayer position. Inhale, stretch your arms up and arch back. Exhale, bend forward all the way. Inhale, left leg backward. Hold the breath, take the other leg. Exhaling, drop the knees, chest, forehead. Inhale, head up, chest up. Exhale, hips up. Inhale, left leg forward. Exhale, right. Inhale, stretch your arms up and arch back. Exhale. Now take a couple of deep breaths. Next set, that is with the right leg and left leg. I'll ask you to hold the each posture and when you are holding the posture, you breathe and try to meditate on that posture. Now you inhale, exhale, palms together, prayer position. Stretch your arms up and arch back. Now bend forward all the way from the hip joints. Place the palms on sets of the feet, chest in. Now right leg back, right knee down, look up. Hold the breath, take the other leg back, body parallel. Straight in a line. Exhaling, drop the knees, chest, forehead down, hips up. Inhale, head up, chest up, arch back as much as you can. Now exhale, hips up, push your heels onto the floor, triangle. Now right leg forward all the way in between the palms, left knee down, look up. Left leg also forward.
स्ट्रेच आर्म्स फॉरवर्ड अप एंड आर्च बैक Exhale, drop the hands. Inhale, now palms together, prayer position. Stretch your arms up and arch back. Bend forward all the way. Fix the palms down. Answers at the feet. Chest into the thighs. Left leg back. Left knee down. Look up. Open your chest. Take your other leg back. Hold the body straight. Exhaling, drop the knees, chest, forehead down, hips up. Stretch your chin forward, head up, shoulders up, chest up, arch back. Hips up, push your heels down. Look at your toes, push back. Inverted V. left leg forward all the way left foot in between the palms right knee down look up right leg also forward Stretch your arms forward, up, and arch back. Exhale, drop the hands. Now take a couple of deep breaths. Once when you feel comfortable, slowly sit down. Then you roll back. Lay down, feet apart, hands apart. Close your eyes. Relax. 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 Slowly bring the feet together. We'll start with the single leg raising exercises. You fix the palms down on the floor, close to the thighs. 
shoulders down tuck the chin towards the chest take couple of deep breaths you inhale expand your diaphragm exhale contract the abdomen in inhale exhale now inhale lift your right leg up all the way feeling the stretch for the back of the thigh try not to bend the knees make sure the back of the left thigh is down on the floor exhale down inhale left leg up knee straight exhale down inhale right leg up exhale down inhale left leg up exhale down inhale right leg up reach up the ankle with both hands you inhale now exhale bring the chest up pull your elbows out try not to bend the knee feel the stretch for the back of the thigh stay in the posture and breathe good now gently grab your right toe with your right hand release your left arm keep it straight on sides of the body now exhaling slowly stretch your right leg down on to the right side pulling your right foot close to your right ear turn your head on to the left making sure that your left leg is straight pull the leg back as much as you can breathe and allow your muscles to relax into the posture good now inhale stretch up change the hands now <clears throat> grab the right toe with your left hand 
Slowly bring the leg down. On to the left side. Turn the head to the right. Breathe and relax. Good. Now inhale, stretch up. Bend your right knee into the chest. Take your arms around the knee. Bring the chest up. Take couple of deep breaths. But here, make sure the left thigh is down on the floor. That is to balance your hips. Exhale, release, head down. Inhale, straighten up the leg. Exhale, down. Now repeat the same on the left leg. Inhale, left leg up. Reach up the ankle with both hands. You inhale, now exhale, bring the chest up. Pull your elbows out. Hold it comfortably. Making sure the back of the right thigh is down on the floor. Now, grab the left toe with your left hand. Stretch your right arm down onto the floor on the right side. Then exhaling, bring the left leg down. Turn your head onto the right. Making sure that your right leg is straight. Breathe and relax into the posture.
Good. Now inhale. Stretch up. Change the hands. Grab the left toe with your right hand. Slowly bring the leg down. All the way. Stretching your left arm onto the left. Turn the head to the left. Relax into the posture and breathe. Make sure the knees are straight. Good. Now inhale. Stretch up. Bend your left knee. Take your arms around the knee. Bring the chin up. Take a couple of deep breaths. Making sure the back of the right thigh is down on the floor. down, inhale, straighten up the leg, exhale, down, very good, now keep the feet together, take a couple of deep breaths before we do the double leg rising exercises. Now if you can, the best way to do will be, take your arms behind your head, Bend your elbows down on the floor. Now you inhale. Exhale. Inhale. Lift both legs up 90 degrees. Exhale. Down. Concentrate on the abdomen. Inhale, up. Make sure the lower back is down on the floor. Exhale, down. Inhale, up. Exhale, down. Inhale, up. Exhale, down. Now we do sideways. Inhale, up. Now both legs to the right. Exhale, down. On to the right side with control. Holding the back. Inhale, up. Now straight. Exhale, down. Inhale, up, to the left, exhale, down, inhale, up, straight, exhale, down, inhale, up, to the right, exhale, down, shoulders down, head down, Inhale, up, straight, exhale, down. Inhale, up, to the left, exhale, down. Inhale, up, 
straight exhale down for the last time inhale up to the right exhale down inhale up straight exhale down inhale up to the left exhale down inhale up straight exhale down perfect feet apart hands apart close your eyes feel all that additional stretch for the thighs abdomen and lower back mentally suggesting the good relaxation while you mentally prepare yourself for the yoga asanas relax 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 Now we will do the yoga asanas Those who can hold the posture hold it as long as you can and if you cannot hold the posture you can come down and come up once again Also in this class we will be doing the variations those who can do the variations you can go ahead and every asana do the variations on the instructions and if you cannot do the variations hold the classical posture as long as you can this rule applies for every asana that we do from now on now gently bring the feet together stretch both arms over behind your head and take a good stretch to the body stretch 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 exhale inhale sit up slowly stretch back into child's pose into shashankasana toes together heels apart sit in between the heels chest onto the thighs take your arms back drop the elbows down relax the shoulders Now while you breathe here you mentally prepare yourself for the headstand the sirsasan known as king of all yoga asanas visualize yourself into the posture that makes the practice easy now gently sit up and take the measurement of your arms bring the elbows down onto the floor release the hands interlock of fingers without moving the elbows now bring the crown of the head down on the floor close to the palms now tuck your toes in lift your knees up gently walk forward all the way until your back comes straight So once when you feel the, that your knees are pulling into the chest gently bring one by one knees into the chest Good Here take couple of deep breaths before you go further Once when you are ready and comfortable gently bring the knees straight up first Once when the knees are straight gently bring the legs up Very good Now try to keep the body straight as much as possible and if it is difficult for you to keep the body straight you always pull your abdomen in and keep the legs slightly bent if you can keep the body straight make sure that you are not arching your back 
Now shift most of the body weight onto the elbows. Let the head rest on the floor. Feet are relaxed. Now breathe. Inhale on one, on two, on three, on four. Exhale on one, on two, on three, on four. Here you are getting all the blood circulation down from the toes into the skull and brain. Think of the benefits. Feel that blood circulation. Remain in the posture for at least five minutes. Then we do the variations. Remember, it is very important that you need to spend minimum time in the posture in order to get the benefits. That was very good. That is the end of five minutes. Now, you stretch your legs apart into 180 degrees if you can with control. Inhale, bring them together. 
स्ट्रेच दम अपार्ट ब्रिंग दम टुगेदर स्ट्रेच दम अपार्ट ब्रिंग दम टुगेदर नाउ स्ट्रेच द लेग्स फॉरवर्ड एंड बैक in the opposite direction as much as you can once again and for the last time good bring the feet together now if you can we're going to do the lotus tuck your right foot on to the left thigh and left foot on to the right thigh now from the lotus slowly twist your body twist the legs all the way feeling that exercise for the pelvis and in the opposite direction bring it straight then slowly bend the knees into the chest with control straight up now arch it as much as you can without losing control bring it straight now straight in your legs now take your own time from here we'll go ahead and do the vrichikasan the scorpion keep the legs slightly apart <coughs> bend your knees wait until you arch enough arch your back now arch it completely as much as you can and now you release your palms palms down on the floor they are parallel to each other gently lift your head up make sure that you keep your upper arm straight arching the back as long as you can hold the upper arm straight in 90 degrees from the floor you can hold this posture very comfortably now you can bring both feet onto the head or you straight in the leg straight up then gently once again you come back into the headstand with control slowly bend your knees knees into the chest gently bring the toes down now here it is very important that you make a fist one on top of the other keep the forehead down under the fist roll your head side to side left to right right to left bring the head straight you take your arms back take couple of deep breaths thinking of the benefits of the sirsasan and the variations that you did gently sit up then slowly roll back lay down feet apart hands apart close your eyes Now you may thoroughly prepare yourself for the next inverted posture which is the sarvangasana breathe and relax
Now slowly bring the feet together. Fix the palms down on the floor. We'll do the Sarvangas in the shoulder stand. Shoulders down. Tuck the chin towards the chest. Now you inhale. Exhale. Inhale. Lift both legs up. Buttocks up. Lower back up. Trunk up. Take support with both palms. Hold it the way you can. Try not to make any corrections. It is very important that you take few deep breaths in every posture before you do the correction. Reason for this is your body and mind need to understand what's going on. Once when you take few deep breaths and if you feel that your body is not straight enough, you can bend both knees onto the forehead and while the knees are on the forehead it's easy for you to bring the elbows closer palms more down on the trunk make sure your trunk is straight 90 degrees to the floor and once again you bring the legs straight up now make a lock with your chin onto the chest This asana is known as mother of all asanas Sarvangasana Here by making a lock with your chin onto the chest you are bringing all the blood down to the neck stopping it there and stimulating your thyroid and parathyroid glands Think of the benefits and relax into the posture remember holding any posture is never difficult first 2 minutes you have a bit of struggle that's when you need to relax and breathe after the 2 minutes it doesn't matter how long you hold the posture remember the definition for yoga asana it's sthira sukham asana the posture which is steady and where you feel comfortable as long as you want is called the yoga asana relax into the posture and breathe that was 4 minutes now exhaling drop your right leg down behind your head into halasan keep your left leg straight up inhale up drop your left leg down behind inhale up Now drop both legs down behind your head. Once when the toes reaches down, you interlock your fingers, stretch your arms. Feel that gentle massage for the spine and lower back. Exercise for the digestive system. We're going to hold this for about two minutes time. The benefits are still. around the neck region 
So concentrate and focus on the thyroid glands. Now gently you come back into the sarvangasan shoulder stand Now this time the support on your back you make sure four fingers on, on the lower back and the thumb is towards the abdomen Good gently arching your back exhaling bend your knees drop the legs down one by one into setu bandhasan the bridge Take your own time. Let go. Once when the feet reaches down, you try to straighten your knees as much as you can, making sure that you you do not change your palms position in the back. Then gently inhaling, lift your right leg up, keeping the knee straight. Exhale down. Inhale left leg up Exhale down Leave the feet parallel to each other close to the buttocks down on the floor Next we do the chakrasan the wheel Place both palms down on the floor under your shoulders Elbows straight up parallel to each other along sides of the ears you inhale exhale now using your arms inhale push up into the chakrasan the wheel very good try to bring your arms straight as much as you can and if you can you slowly walk close to the feet If you cannot you just stay leaving the palms down where they are and breathe Now putting all the body weight onto the palms gently inhaling lift your right leg up Try to bring it straight as much as you can Exhale down Inhale left leg up Exhale down Now gently lifting the head up slowly come down onto the floor Once when you reach down you bend your knees into the chest take your arms around the knees and take couple of deep breaths this is the counter stretch for the chakrasan the wheel both setu bandhasan and chakrasan helps to make your spine more flexible now release the hands head down inhale straighten up the legs exhale using your abdominal muscles gently come down very good 
feet apart hands apart take couple of deep breaths before we do the machhasan the fish which is the counter stretch for sarvangasan Now bring the feet together. We'll do the machhasan, the fish. Take your arms under your body, making sure that your arms are straight under the body. Elbows are under the lower back. Feet together. Keep them relaxed. Now inhale. Lift your head up, chest up. Drop your top portion of the head back. down onto the floor now let let the head rest on the floor shift the body weight onto the elbows now you inhale deeply into the diaphragm exhale out the, through the diaphragm your entire respiratory system is wide open This asana is to help you to strengthen the thyroid region. Make sure that your feet are relaxed and keep breathing. Now we come out of this posture. Inhaling lift your head up look at the toes exhale chest down head down Now release your hands feet apart hands apart roll your head side to side Left to right right to left Bring the head straight. Take few deep breaths. Now mentally suggesting give a complete relaxation for the thyroid region. Relax. 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 Good. Now the next asana we're going to do is the forward bend pachimottanasan gently bring the feet together stretch both arms over behind your head inhale a good stretch to the body stretch 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 exhale inhale sit up now in this asana we start with one variation You first stretch your legs apart into 180 degrees if you can or as much as you can Once when the legs are stretched keep the back straight stretch both arms straight up stretch up up Now exhaling slowly turn on to the right side bend forward on to the right leg all the way Catch hold of the toes or ankle wherever you can reach. Then as you exhale, you bring the chest forward onto the thigh. Pull your elbows down as much as you can. Breathe, making sure that left leg is stretched sideways as far as you can. Breathe and relax into the posture.
Good. Now stretch your arms forward and up. Stretch up, 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 up. Gently go down onto the left. Now exhaling onto the other side. Whenever do you do an exercise on both sides of the body, you make sure to spend equal time on each side. in order to bring the balance and not to over stretch on, on one side extra this particular exercise helps to open your pelvis and hips and it exercises the hamstrings one at a time so that the actual paschimottanasana will be easy after to do good now stretch your arms forward and up stretch up 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 then gently bring the feet together now we do the paschimottanasana now stretch your arms up stretch up up and exhale bend forward all the way Try to catch hold of the toes or ankles wherever you can, pulling the elbows down, bringing the shoulders forward, bring the chest onto the thighs. Now make sure here you are not twisting your feet. That can result in twisting your hips. So try to keep the foot straight and they are relaxed, and bring the chest forward as much as you can. feeling the exercise for the hamstrings try not to bend the knees totally relax into the posture breathe and relax Good. Now stretch your arms forward and up. Stretch up. Exhale. Drop the hands behind you, down on the floor. Now we'll do the counter stretch for Paschimottanasana, which is the Purvottanasana. Inhaling, you lift your hips up, toes on the floor, drop your head back. Make sure the hips are up. as much as you can breathe at least 8 deep breaths if you feel like you can do always the leg variations here otherwise hold the posture and breathe then gently exhaling come down very good slowly roll down onto the abdomen makarasan in preparation for the backward bends now make a pillow with the palms keep your right cheek onto the palms 
toes together heels apart breathe now inhale expand your diaphragm exhale contract it now we will do the bhujangasan the cobra release the hands fix both palms down on the floor on sides of the chest finger tips in line with the shoulders elbows straight up tuck them into the body toes and heels are together toes pointing back now as you inhale stretch your chin forward head up shoulders up chest up all the way making sure that your hips are down on the floor look back shoulders relaxed feel that exercise for the spine from top to the bottom the contraction in order to help to stimulate your adrenal glands breathe and relax into the posture now exhaling slowly stretch the chin forward all the way come down forehead in now we do the king cobra purna bhujangasan move your palms back a little bit stretch your legs apart at least 2 feet apart now as you inhale stretch your chin forward head up shoulders up chest up all the way look back now turn your head look over your right shoulder look at the left foot behind you without moving the shoulders now turn the head on to the left look at your right foot behind you then bring the head straight drop it more back bend your knees slowly touch both feet on to the forehead or wherever you can reach hold it and breathe comfortably exhaling slowly release make a pillow with the palms keep your cheek under the palms toes together heels apart Now the next backward bend we're going to do is the shalabhasan the locust release your hands stretch your chin forward down on the floor now take your arms under your body making sure that your arms are straight elbows are under the abdomen the more you stretch the chin forward the easy it is to do this posture now first we do the single legs to feel that stretch inhaling lift your right leg up all the way without tilting the pelvis exhale down inhale left leg up exhale down now we do both legs elbows more in chin forward you inhale exhale now inhale lift both legs up all the way roll up very good if you can go all the way up 
bend your knees and bring both feet either on the head or in front of your head if you cannot do that keep the legs up as much as you can breathe and relax into the posture now using your arm strength exhaling slowly come down in this asana you get the contraction from bottom to the top to make your spine completely flexible make a pillow with the palms toes together heels apart think of the benefits of the asana now we do the last backward bend the dhanurasana the bow release your hands keep the forehead down bend your knees grab your ankles with your hands now you inhale exhale now inhale slowly stretch your chin forward head up shoulders up chest up legs up thighs up making sure that you are balancing on the navel portion of the body not on the hips when you are up in the posture in order to get more exercise you try to bring the knees together that gives hyper contraction for the entire back chin up head up and breathe now those who can you can pull both feet either onto the head or onto the shoulders Now if you feel like you can rock your body forward and back then gently release the posture Make a pillow with the palms toes together heels apart Now we'll do the counter stretch stretch back like a cat and come into the child's pose Shashankasan This is the counter stretch for the three backward bends we did Breathe and relax Now the next asana we do is the Ardha Machhendrasana half spinal twist. Gently sit up. Now sit on to the right side. Take the left foot up on the outside of your right thigh. Pull your left knee into the chest. Now take your right shoulder around the left knee catch hold of your left foot or the right knee wherever you can now left arm either leave it behind you if you have enough balance take it onto your back now try not to shrink down keep the back straight look over and above the left shoulder feeling the twist relax into the posture
gently release the posture now change the legs sit on to the left side take the right foot up over on the outside of your left thigh take your left arm left shoulder around the right knee catch hold of your right toe or the left knee then look over and above the right shoulder right arm you take it behind you breathe feel the twist and relax into the posture Good now exhale release Now bend both knees into the chest Take your arms around the knees back straight Look over the right shoulder over the left Bring the head straight Now squat on the floor. We'll do the balancing posture. You have a choice of doing either the peacock or the crow. In either of this posture, stay longer. Lean the body forward. Keep the head up and hold the posture. For those who is doing peacock make sure to lift the head up and then the legs up and for those who is doing crow the more you come away from the floor the easier it is to hold the posture both balancing postures helps tremendously to improve your concentration and the positive thinking gently come out of this posture and now you stand up we'll do the padahastasan the standing forward bend stretch both arms straight up inhaling stretch up as high as you can exhale bend forward all the way from the hip joints either you can catch hold of the toes or place the palms on sides of the feet down on the floor or clasp the ankles behind in either of this variation you make sure to bring the chest close to the thighs and hold this posture longer but shift the body weight onto the toes not onto the heels breathe and hold the posture try not to bend the knees 
This particular asana helps to exercise hamstrings and to stretch the spine at the same time it improves your sense of balancing breathe and relax into the posture Good now gently release your hands crawl up very good now we do the last asana first we do the classical posture of the triangle trikonasana then we do one variation now stretch your legs apart they should be at least 3 to 4 feet apart heels are in straight line feet are parallel to each other then gently turn your right foot out maintaining the heels in straight line place your right palm onto the right thigh left arm straight up along side of the left ear then exhaling bend sideways without twisting the pelvis without closing the hips move the right palm down as much as you can left arm parallel to the floor chest slightly facing up and try to look up feel that stretch for the thighs and exercise for the waist region <clears throat> breathe and relax Inhale stretch up Turn the right foot in left foot out Place your left palm onto the left thigh right arm straight up Exhaling slowly go down onto the left all the way repeat the same posture breathe and relax into the asana Now inhaling slowly stretch up We'll do the variation Turn your right foot out Interlock your fingers behind your back Gently bend your right knee forward left thigh close to the floor stretching your arms up above the head bring the head down onto the floor 
arms stretching towards the floor left thigh parallel to the floor and breathe with control make sure to hold the arms strong try not to loosen up the arms then you lose the balance now inhale stretch up arms towards the buttocks bring the body up with control and repeat the same thing on to the left side when you are in the posture always breathe and relax exhaling go down inhaling come up Once when you are ready, slowly sit down and roll back. Lay down for final relaxation, the savasan. Now think of all the asanas that you did before we start the process of relaxation. Now we feel the remaining tensions in our body. Lift your right leg six inches up from the floor. Feel if there is any tension. Let it go. Left leg up. Drop. Both legs. Drop. Hips up. Drop. Chest up. drop squeeze your shoulder squeeze 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 drop lift both hands up make a fist make a fist open the fingers widely tense drop roll the head side to side left to right right to left bring the head straight Now squeeze your face bring all the tension into the face squeeze 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 open the mouth widely and exhale relax the face relax the forehead let all the body parts be free on the floor now focus your mind on your breathing inhale on one Om two, om three, om four. Exhale om one, om two, om three, om four. Gradually slow down the breathing. At the same time, you visualize your body's picture in your mind. I'll suggest your body parts. you relax them once when i suggest relax your toes you mentally repeat i am relaxing my toes my toes are relaxed think of your breathing alone concentrate on my voice just on my voice relax your toes heels ankles calf muscles knees th 
Heiß. Hip Joint. Hip Bones. Buttocks. Pelvis. Abdomen. Lower back. Spinal column. Shoulder blades. Upper back, ribs, lungs. chest fingers palms wrist Four arms, elbows, upper arms, shoulders. Hall bones, neck and throat, relax the chin, mouth, nose eyes forehead cheeks Yes. Skull and brain. Now we go deep and deeper into the relaxation. Relax your internal organs. Spleen, bladder, liver, 
kidneys, small and large intestines. Relax your entire body. You have no tensions in your body. No worries in your mind. You enjoy that peace and relaxation for your body and mind. Relax. 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 in your body stretch your fingers toes gently bring the feet together stretch both arms over behind your head inhale the good stretch to the body stretch 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 exhale Inhale, sit up. Cross your legs. Keep the back straight. Close your eyes. Focus your mind on your breathing.
त्रयंबकं यजामहे सुगंधिं पुष्टिवर्धनं पूर्वारुकमेव बंधनां मृत्योर मुक्षेमामृता ओम त्रयंबकं यजामहे सुगंधिं पुष्टिवर्धनं पूर्वारुकमेव बंधनां मृत्योर मुक्षेमामृता ओम त्रयंबकं यजामहे सुगंधिं पुष्टिवर्धनं पूर्वारुकमेव बंधनां मृत्योर मुक्षेमामृता ओम सर्वेशां स्वस्तिर्बवदो सर्वेशां शांतिर्बवदो सर्वेशां पोनं बवदो सर्वेशां मंगलं बवदो सर्वे भवन्तो सुकिनः सर्वे सांतु निरामया सर्वे भद्रानि पश्यन्तो माकस्चेक दुकबाग भवे आसदो मासत कमया तमसो माजो तिर्गमया मृत्योर मामृतंगमया ओम पोनमदा पोनमिदं पोनात पोनमुदच्छदे पोनाश्या पोनमादाया पोनमेवा वशिष्यते ओम शांति 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 ओम पीस 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 बोलो सदगुरु शिवानंद महाराज की जय स्वामी विष्णुदेवानंद महाराज की जय हरिओम